The next day began early. Our elephants were waiting. Amin introduced me to 21-year-old Heidi El Husseini, an English university graduate who was brave enough to join me on a trek into the unknown. One of the, one of the things you can enjoy is elephant trekking on the Songaria River. So let's see if we can climb aboard. Kolo! 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 I tell you what, it's a long way up. <laughs> the river here was moving at a fast pace, and even up high on the elephant, the current looked threatening. Luckily, our friend was heavy enough and sure-footed enough to stay clear of trouble. Our feet were dry, but the monsoon rain soon cooled the rest of us down. Now this is dense evergreen jungle. Now you might like to explore it on foot, but maybe you prefer a four-wheel drive. This is wild terrain and it's a bumpy but exhilarating drive. Chains helped to keep traction in the mud. But of course it had to happen. Time to get out and push. We were soon on our way again, only to face the next challenge the narrow bridge across to the river rafts. If that wasn't scary enough, we then spotted our raft. This was more adventure than we'd bargained for. Yeah. Come down to hold on to the tree. Uh, uh, uh. Get on. Okay. No problem. <laughs> yeah. This is for the serious explorer who enjoys to be surrounded by a vivid tapestry of colour. Nature truly enfolds you, and as the river sweeps you further and further into the dense green of the jungle, time seems unimportant. All that matters is the moment. <laughs> So what do you think, Heidi? Um, it's incredible. I really think that you wouldn't find this sort of stunning scenery and find yourself in such a remote place anywhere else in Thailand. And we're in the rainy season, so you, the river's quite swollen, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, if you look, yeah, it's just, you can see how it's probably come up quite far on the banks and, yeah, it's quite, it's quite fast moving as well. So we did elephant trekking this morning. Is this a bit more peaceful? <laughs> well, except that we were caught in the middle of a monsoon, which, um, yeah, I suppose has to happen at some point, doesn't it? <laughs> That's the real experience of monsoon weather. Catch you off guard. But it's a great way to explore the jungle like this, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, there's no other way that you can see it. I mean, you've got everything here. You've got the river, you've got the jungle, you've got everything overhead. It's just absolutely stunning. I tell you what, there's not a better way to explore the jungle than this. This is a raft. We've got the green luscious forest on the outside and lots of branches to have to evade as well. But it's a great experience and well worth the visit. I think it's important that every once in a while people remove themselves from where they are and 
get back to this sort of experience and remind themselves of what, what it's truly about and what's out here and what we have to try and conserve. We cruised on, the day drifted by, and as the sun slowly sank, we turned a little reluctantly towards the shore and our path back home. Oh, well done. Thank you very much. How was that? Mm, amazing. <laughs> well, amazing time. Not bad, eh? <laughs> 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 <laughs>